My opponent is ranked 172. I've never played somebody ranked so high. Let's see what this dude is all about. And for some weird reason, I play better against better opponents. Like when I play bums and people that suck, I seem to have a harder time against them. I don't know what it is, but uh, when I lose, I almost always lose to somebody with a shitty record. I go back after the game and I check their record and it's like 30 and 66 or something. So now I'm playing against the Seahawks. You know this guy's rank and I don't want to throw in an interception so I stick to the ground game and my running scheme and it's almost unstoppable. Especially when you mix it in once in a while with the halfback screen. You're going to keep your opponent on his toes. Look at that. <laughs> I drove that blocker into my lineman. So fullback inside is a great play, even though I have to run it with the tight end there. So back to the halfback screen, it's second and seven, and we get almost a first down. We got third and one. We put Alfred Morris in as fullback, and we give it to him. And he just about gets the first down. That's why, and look, triple option. Pistol weak. <laughs> it is Amazing. This play is amazing, and I didn't want to fumble because I've been running the ball a lot, so I just went down. So now we, we're sticking with that same formation, but we do the halfback. I think it's halfback dive, pistol weak. It's a good complement to the triple option. So second and nine, we go back to the triple option, and we try to get the first down. I love this play, man. My, my only problem now is I use it too much. But... Hand the ball to Alfred Morris, gets us a first down. We are taking so much time off the clock with this drive. It's already in the second quarter. We fake to Alfred Morris and pitch it out to Ezekiel, but he 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 stopped that play pretty good. It's second and eight. Ah, oh, look at that hole. Look at that hole. So we get down to the goal line. We didn't score, but it's third and inches. Fake to the fullback, and he stops us. He has a good defense. Oh no, he doesn't. Ezekiel breaks free, baby. Touchdown. That was almost a quarter and a half taken off. Now he's right away in five wide. We're in the dollar defense. Look, we got that covered. We're in the play spinner that's in our new tournament style defensive ebook, but we make it a coverage play. Damn. He's, back. he's got nowhere to throw. I'm sending three people at him. Three. And I'm sacking him. So he fakes the handoff and he's trying to go deep, but no one's open. And that was covered. Now it's fourth down. Look, I'm doing a play spinner from the dollar formation, but I don't all the time keep them, all those guys blitzing. I adjust to what I think my opponent's doing with the linebackers and the cornerbacks that are blitzing. So it's fourth and 23. He's in five wide again. He goes back to pass. We're sending three at him and he goes up and we pick him off. That That's like a punt right there anyway, but we pick him off and look at this. I'll see you later, buddy. I'll see you later, Mr. 172 rank. Bye-bye. Man, he quit. He quit. What a bum. What? This dude was ranked 172? He sucked. Our new tournament-style defensive ebook is 15 bucks over 200 defensive plays. And we're going to show you how to get it for 50% off. Keep watching. Don't go anywhere. We are going to give you guys another nice defensive play. So you guys can add that to your arsenal. Stay tuned. Like this video and subscribe. Okay, now we are going over a 4-6 bear formation. Those of you that use this formation know it's good against the run. You're not going to have your opponent run up the middle against you at all. I mean, look at this beefy front. You got everybody right up at the line the linebackers they're not going to run up the middle on you but what play we're going against uh we're going over is the slant week three but i flipped the play i like to run it again you could run this the normal way to the right how it was designed but i flipped the play at the call screen so it's running this linebacker is blitzing on the left now just to show you 
running backs being blocked, and we're on all Madden level, just like all of our defensive tips all year. We're on all Madden level. Now, what you want to do, there's two ways to set this up, just to try to confuse the offensive line. You want to just baseline, always, when you break the huddle, Y or triangle right in the D-pad. Then sh shift the D-line to the right, left on the D-pad, right on the D-pad. Slant them to the right, left on the D-pad, right on the right stick. But then when you did that, it takes this defensive end out of his zone and blitz him to Now it's a six-man blitz, but take him off of his blitz. L1 twice, his icon is circle, and then whatever. You wanna put him in a hard flat? You can, which I like to do. Now you're gonna take this blitzing middle linebacker and just move him over to the right right above this defensive tackle stay you if you can get off of him and he stays there that's good and he's gonna come around just like that just like he did it and I didn't put a fast linebacker in so you want to put your fastest linebacker in this blitzing linebackers position so baseline shift the D-line to the right, slant them to the right, and take that guy, the right screen the end. This time I put him in a curl flap. And just move the blitzing linebacker to his over that defensive tackle. Sometimes if you don't user him, he could go back to the left spot. But let's try that. He took a couple steps back. Which still the blitz came in. So baseline, shift D-line right, slant them right, take them off his blitz, and just move him right. If you see that he, the linebacker, blitzing linebacker, goes back into his original position when you get off of him, stay in control of him. But only now you're just not going to use it in the middle of the field. You're going to try and sack the QB. Just like that. Sorry about the annoying controller. So, I mean, look, you're not going to do this against four or five wide, obviously, but single back ace, anything like this. This is perfect. And look, when that running back goes to try and block me, the guys on the right are going to come in. The defensive line didn't move. Come on, man. Move. Oh, the, look. See? You know, this formation, everybody's so bunched up. Somebody always comes in. But you want it to come in smooth. Just like that. Look at how fast that is. Baseline, shift D-line right, slant them to the right, and take him off his blitz. The right is screen the end. Wow, look at that. Now, the other way to set this up is just baseline, slant the D-line to the right without shifting him, and then take the guy, that same defensive end, off of his blitz, and now just put this guy above the defensive tackle that's above the center. I like the first way we went over, but just to give a different look, maybe put him a little bit almost in the middle of that gap there. He didn't have to go that wide. Just like that. So you can, you know, there's a lot of times if you keep using this play and your opponent keeps seeing you shift the D-line and then move this guy over, he's going to know what's coming. And you got decent coverage on the field. I mean, you got a hard flat and you got a purple to one side. You know, if he stays here, you could use your control this guy. Oh, now, now the offensive line, now they're getting smart to this play.
but you're going to produce a lot of heat with this play. It's going to shut down the run. I put this play in our tournament style defensive ebook, which now you can get for 50% off. 50% off. The ebook is $15, but still, that code that we had 50% off still works. All you have to do is type beat me, one word, lowercase letters, in the coupon code when you go to check out. You can get this $15 ebook for $7.50. Over 200 defensive plays, every defensive formation. If you're still looking to purchase ebooks and get an edge on your opponent defensively, where are you going to get an ebook for over that has over 200 defensive plays? Right here. Just go to gamingauthority.com, go to the ebooks page, or you could just make it easier and go to the link in the description and use that beat me code for 50 percent off thank you guys for watching like this video subscribe to us i'm jp storm with gamingauthority.com